What's good, so once again, you know her name is T, so as we back for another day of hitting them books, you feel me? I you talking about today's Thunder and Tide, this is me showing you how to braid your dreads, my boy. This can go with regular hair too, you feel me? So, if you just got regular hair and you ain't got dreads, it work with you too. Only thing difference is that our hair is already parted, yours is not, you just gonna have to make the three parts to braid. Yes, my boy, I learned how to braid hair the right way. I hope it's the right way, it look like braids, you feel me? So... Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. I started doing my own hairstyles with like my own hair, bro. I don't know if y'all can see this, but this is my dread that's holding the little hair together like a little ponytail, whatever y'all want to call this. Yeah, that's something new, you feel me? Something new I just discovered to do. But yeah, I'm only doing two braids. One on the left side, one on the right side. So make sure y'all stay tuned for that. Yeah, I ain't gonna hold y'all a little way too long. Subscribe to my second channel. I'm dropping bangers on there, bro. Almost. I'm dropping bangers on there every week. I know that for sure. I'm trying to do it every other day, you feel me? But I'm gonna show dropping bangers on there every week. So stay tuned for that, you feel me? Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Let's get straight into this. All right, so first I'm about to section my hair off. You feel me? Take this out. And I'll go like this. Straight down the middle. Simple. Just like this, and I grab all these hairs. I'm gonna do my right side first, you feel me? Grab all these hairs, put them like this. So now I just got this side to work with, you know what I'm saying? Don't forget you need these little, hold on, these little rubber bands, you feel me? So if you don't know how to braid the back, I'm gonna try to braid the back, but first I'm gonna get the braid first, then I'm gonna try to braid the back after and show y'all that result, but this is what you do. Flip the hair back and grab three dreads in the same row, bro. They could be in the same row or they could just be close, like how these are super close together. Actually, I'm going to use this one. I always prefer to use the same row like this. You feel me? That's first row. And what you want to do, pull into the back, take the one on the right, put it in the middle. Take the one on the left, put it in the middle. Actually, I want my hair to go to the outside. So I'm, I'm going to put the one on the left in the middle first. Then put the one on the right in the middle first. I said first, second. And then put the one that was in the middle, put it to the left. Then put that in the middle. Just like this. And you keep going. Y'all see how I keep going like this? And then you may be like, what do I do when I get to the other dread? This is all you literally have to do, bro. Grab the hair and then put it through. Just cross it over. Just straight up cross it over just like this. As if it was the one dread. And cross it over like this. Just like that. And this is all I kept doing, bro. Just kept crossing them over and bringing them across. Just like this. And I keep pulling it so it could be tight. You feel me? You gotta have them tight dreads. And I just keep going like this. Over and over. People call this a barrel twist or something, but bro, this is like braids, so I'm not the best braider at all, bro. I'm not gonna say that. But this is what you should do if you're like a really beginner, because like I'm a beginner too, so you can get better with me, you feel me? As y'all see, I just keep on repeating the same process over and over and over until I get all the way to the back, you feel me? Make sure that you're not leaving out no dreads, bro. Don't forget the ones that's right behind it. Don't forget the ones that's all the way on the sides. Because then you got to start all the way over. I don't know if y'all can actually see the braid shape right now. But it's actually looking like a braid now, you feel me? It should start coming in. Yes, your arms is going to hurt, bro. My arms is burning low-key. But all you need is that little five-second break, and you can get right back to what you was doing, Cash. You can pull tight if you want to. I don't really prefer pulling super tight because y'all know your head gonna be burning or throbbing or something. Now, this is where the rubber band will come in handy, you feel me? When you don't know how to braid the back. Take the rubber band, open it up, and right where the braid ends, like where it starts getting to the loose hairs and all that, put a rubber band on it, you feel me? Just like this. It's best to have a mirror, bro, because, yeah, I'm going to have to redo this because I'm not looking in the mirror right now. Like I once said earlier, I'm not the best braider, but, like, I'm going to get all this done, you feel me? This is what it should look like at the front, though, you feel me? Y'all see the little braid look right here? And then it's just all this hair. I'm about to fix that right now, but I'm going to show you when I finish both of the sides of my head. Yeah, we're going to get up out of here, you know what I'm saying? Let's get it. Two hours later. All right, so look, y'all, I just finished, you feel me? Only reason I don't really wear braids is because, bro, like when I look straight, it look like my head is like weird, bro. But y'all can see some hair is loose. And I did not know what I was doing with this down here. So like I tried to braid some of the hairs that was braidable, right? And I put hair, like rubber bands on Y'all see I still got some hair sticking out. Like I gotta fix that. I'm gonna work on it, you feel me? This is really my first time ever braiding my hair fully to the point where I'm just gonna keep it in for like a couple of days. But I did this side pretty well. It's not really that much loose hairs out, you feel me? It's my favorite side, of course. My left side is my favorite side. And then my right side, it just 
my right side always been like that. Always just do what it do. You feel me? But that's why I got a whole bunch of rubber bands. I got a rubber band right here. I got one where right here. I got another one somewhere up here. Then I got one somewhere up here, right here, and then down here. You feel me? I'm probably gonna end up redoing them, but this is like the base. I just really wanted to show y'all this part of like the hair. You feel me? So y'all can get the full clue on how to do it. I don't know how to do the ends. Once again, y'all see the hair sticking out like crazy, but I'm gonna make it work one day. One day we gonna get it right. We gonna fix this, you feel me? But I'm gonna just show y'all here. Go to the left side, you feel me? Like the left profile is how it's looking, my guy, you feel me? The right side is looking like this, you know what I'm saying? The top of it is looking like this. No retwist, my boy. So that's why it's looking like this. I really don't care when I braid my hair, so like. And then here go the back. This is what it's looking like from the back. I can't really. Is y'all in it? Oh yeah, it's in there. This is what the back looking like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, hopefully that y'all did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you like, comment, and if you're new, subscribe. For more dread content, comment more videos you want me to do, and I got you. I will shout you off if you have a good video idea. Subscribe to my second channel. Make sure that gets to 600 subscribers. We halfway there, you feel me? Y'all getting there quick. 1,000 on the way. 20K on the way on this channel. We about to hit that soon. Trust me. Yes, yeah, so I got to say, so on the game, no game. We out.